don't let me turn up with the singing this video. The video just started. What am I doing singing? Like, I not every time, bro. I'm out here singing. I'm dropping notes on y'all. Like, I'm letting Mariah Carey know I'm better. I'm a better singer than her. It's like. I feel like mad disrespectful at this point because like not everybody need to be hearing my beautiful vocals every time I hop on, you know what I mean? I'll pop in the video. But hey, what's up, man? You know what it is, man. See what it is. We are in the building, man. So today, we're going to be reacting to another one of People of the New Bears trailers. A lot of speculations coming about with this game. People saying it's fake. It's this and that. It's, um, it looks too good to be true. But I talked to the creator of the game. I think he is Russian, if I'm not mistaken. Talks to the creator of the game, he's Russian. He also said that it's not a big development team like EA. It's not a, a big development team like EA. I'm not sure Paralives team, how big their team is, how deep their team is. But um, it's not a big production team. It says it's just three people. It's him, the one who's actually like, creating the game and you know thinking everything like that. And then there's like the interface designer and then there's the, um, I forgot what the other one is. I forgot, he really texted me it somewhere, but um, yeah. That's what he said. So it's not a big, it's not a big group. That's why a lot of this stuff could look like it's just homemade because it probably is homemade because he's making the game himself. So that's why it's not gonna look like his big production. But without further ado, I ain't here to, I ain't here to debate. I ain't here to speculate. No cap. We here to review. We here to react. You already know what it is, man. I ain't gonna talk too much. But you guys already know what to do. Whether you're old or new, make sure to like, comment, subscribe button. A little spicy with that Dang. I put my little face thing at the bottom right over here because of the way all right immediately 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 one of the things i know this is uploaded in 720p hope well, i was hoping we could have got this in 1080 but 720 seems like the max cap, um, cap, uh, capability i don't know if you guys watched this already but this is my first time watching it um but you see the reflection off the beard so the beard looks a little golden as of right now that shader or whatever it's called that that little um reflection thing it needs to be fixed because the, the beard, I don't know, the beard just makes the beard look fake, but there's no way that the beard has reflection, like it's like shining like with oil or something like that, you know what I mean? So that needed to be fixed. But, you know, I'm just, I'm just watching. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna be, I ain't gonna be talking about it, you know what I mean? Oh my Jesus, I'll skip my parts of it. The room, okay, I like the little closet door opening. I like that. Okay. Muscle mass, muscular, age, active, weight, muscular. Wait, okay. I like the, okay, so basically it's going back to the slider things. It reminds me of The Sims 3. Y'all played The Sims 3. It's not like no click and actually mold the Sims body to the shape you want in The Sims 4. It's Sims 3 sliders, you know what I mean? I wonder how difficult that's gonna get in terms of customization. I wonder how that's gonna work, if you could download mods for the game, if there's even gonna be CC for the game. And I wonder if people are even gonna create CC for the game if there is. So that's gonna be a thing too, because usually when I play my game, I play with CC, I can't play base game. I can't play just pure um, Maxis, whatever the heck. Um, I just can't play like that. Maxis, Max CC, I'll definitely play some of that. But you know, I just can't play just whatever game pack stuff come out, because EA don't know style sometimes. EA, EA Maxis, they don't know style. I don't know what they be putting in the game, but hell no, I'm not playing with the base game stuff. So there's gonna be a, there's gonna need to see, I need to see some drip, because I'm not gonna have my Sims, I mean my people walking around in suits. I need to see some drip, I need to see some style, I need to see some stuff. The clothing is definitely gonna be big for this game. Hmm. Okay, four eyebrows to start with. It looks like character customization is a little bit limited as of right now. I feel like that's gonna change pretty soon. It's a little bit limited. It's a little bit limited, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. 10 options, brow height. Okay, okay, pupil, eye shape. Okay, very limited on eye shapes as well. I'm guessing you could change it. There's a base eye shape and then you could change it. He got this music hanging in the hold on. I give not. Hey. Hey. Okay, okay, I like the color wheel thing. I like I like the color wheel thing for the for the hair and stuff like that. It's not just like a regular base like swatches. It's not anything. It's a color wheel. Giving me back the Sims 3 vibes, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? There's some things in the Sims 3 that, I, that you know, wouldn't, that I wouldn't want back in the game, like the body sliders. 
I wouldn't want that back in The Sims. If they had The Sims 3 with the, like the body molding, like The Sims 4, and you could literally drag and change the Sim however you want, Sims 3 would have been, un uh, without a doubt, the best Sims ever. Right now, it's the best Sims ever, in my opinion, in a lot of people's opinion. It's the best Sims to ever grace the planet. But, you know, the character customization was a little, eh, mm, the CC wasn't that good, as, as good as uh, Sims 4. It's a little, eh, mm, eh, you know what I mean? But, it's still the greatest, it's still the greatest Sims to ever grace the planet, and that's no cap. And that's no cap. I like this beard thing, though. I like the color wheel. The color wheel is going to give us a little more in-depth of, like, um, customization options, because you can literally have a custom hair color. I like that. Oh, the women. Okay, the women's what it's gonna be at. But do y'all see like the actual realism of them though? Like this is really, really, really realistic. Like I like this realism thing that they got going on. This looks really real. Like people, actual humans. I like the couch. Like, look at the details. They have some details in here too. The closet doors are open, you know what I mean? The details, there's lighting um things going on. It looks like they just immediately take the background for wherever you, like, you use the mirror or the dressing, the dresser from to change up your sim. It looks like that's where your or your player just um, goes in the, right there. It's not like no sims cast loading screen where it's like a cast background. It looks like wherever the mirror is, the background is literally what's behind the person at the time that they're changing their clothes. Which is, which is fire, I hope. I like that move. Okay. I like that. These look really, really, really realistic. I really hope, like, Daniel Gerasimov. Is that the person? Dan Daniel Gerasimov. I like these. I like that a lot. I really like that a lot. Look at the hair shadow and everything. Coming out. This is really realistic. I like that. I like that. Are right, you guys having speculation about this game too? A lot of people are like, I can't, I can't, I don't think it's true, this and that. The owner of the creator of the game is like, a lot of people like have a speculation about the game. Like, oh, it's not real, this and that. It's too good to be true. But all he like, he says, um, you just have to wait and find out. You just have to wait and find out. So he has, he's obviously seeing the speculation, obviously uh, feeling the speculation, obviously feeling like, oh, it's a fake game. He's hearing these comments. I guess he just wants to prove the people wrong. I hope he proves me wrong as well because I need to see like a demo or like something going on to let me know, all right. This game is here and it's in the convo with Paralives and Sims. Cause right now, I want any company, I want any company to give EA, I'm gonna go rant for a minute. I want any company to give EA a run for their money right now. I don't care if I, if I lose EA Game Changer, I'm not even no Game Changer or if they don't give it to me, I don't know. But I'm not gonna sit here and allow a company just because I wanna be a Game Changer or not, but to to, to treat their, their customers, the people who pay their bills this way. We're the people who made your company. There's no way you're treating us like this. There's no way you're doing this to us. And there's also an age slider up there. But there's no way you're doing this to us. Giving us stuff we didn't ask for, the least voted, or whatever the heck. You see the backlash you got. Drop some heat next time. If y'all drop another pack we don't want, it really might be Boycott EA for a lot of people. Not saying it's me exactly, but for a lot of people. People are fed up with gaming companies. I've been fed up with 2K for a while because 2K has just been passing off the same game. And it's so bad that Take-Two Interactive is just known as a company that, ah, they're just so 2K is to give us the same game again. And that's a bad rep for you to have as a company. Especially a multi-million dollar, billion dollar company, whatever the hell some of these are. To, to be like this, that's a bad rep to have. If y'all want me to do a whole EA rant video, I will rant about EA. I don't care. I will rant about EA. I'll go into Madden if I got to. I will rant about this damn company. Cause I'm tired of these game companies selling us short. I ain't gonna say too much. But you guys already know what to do. Whether you're old or you're new, make sure you like the video first of all. I see you beautiful. You're higher. You made it to this part of the video. You're mad beautiful. I see you. Make sure you like the video so other beautiful people like yourself can see this. But anyways. You guys already know what to do. If they're older you new, make sure to like, comment, subscribe button. With that! Hey.